here's how to hide banking apps on iPhone. So first, let's say we want to hide these two banking apps. What we can do is tap and hold on the app and then come down to where it says require face ID and go ahead and tap on that. This is gonna ask us if we wanna require face ID for Chase. Now it gives us two different options. So we can either require face ID, so it will still show up on our home screen, but it will require a face ID for us to open the app, or we can hide and require face ID, which is going to hide the app from the home screen and also require face ID to open it. So if we go ahead and click on where it says hide and require face ID, it's gonna ask us, do we want to hide Chase? It's gonna obscure the app appearance and we're also gonna receive no notifications, calls, or alerts from the Chase app. So if we go ahead and click on where it says hide app, it's gonna remove that from our home screen. We can also do this for our other banking app. So if we go ahead and tap and hold on the app, then come down to where it says require face ID, tap on where it says hide and require face ID, click on where it says hide app. It's gonna remove that from our home screen. Now, in order to actually find the hidden banking apps that we just hid, we can come over to our apps drawer if by swiping right. If we scroll all the way to the bottom, we can see this hidden area right here. If we tap on hidden, it's gonna require face ID. And now we can see both of our apps that we just hid that we required face ID for. If we want to unhide them, all we have to do is tap and hold on the app and then tap on where it says don't require face ID. That will unhide the app and remove it from the hidden section.